Well, hello guys. In this video I'm going to show you how to fix the error GFX initial boot in GTI 5. Well, it's my first video on YouTube. I just took the picture, I took the video with my camera and it's pretty easy. Well, first of all, you go to your desktop then you find your GTA 5 folder I don't know where you have a disk C here and I'm gonna find my folder here it is Rockstar Games or Grand Theft Auto 5 well, and what I'm gonna do is find the source of the problem the 3D3 compiler 46.dll files I'm gonna take them to and delete them permanently well after it's deleted I'm gonna make sure that it is deleted from my recycle bin 2 okay so after that I'm gonna close that window and then I'm going to launch the game from the desktop. I note that uh, I have the retail version so it's not a cracked version. In this case I'm gonna right click on Grand Theft Auto 5 and I'm going to run as administrator. Well you see that um, this language is Greek so I'm just um, trying to explain it in English. So right click on Grand Theft Auto 5 Launches administrator, click yes, and then the file should automatically, the game should automatically download these two files again after you logged in in Social Club. <coughs> Just waiting here a moment, it's loading. Well, I've signed in. still loading so it's downloading the two files still waiting and Grand Theft Auto 5 is now ready to play <coughs> after that you click on play and the game should work normally it's the first time that I found a patch for this problem. Um, I've had this problem for several months now. And it's the only thing that worked. I just finished playing two and a half hours without any crash or upcoming of this error. And I think that it might just work for you too. So thank you for watching and I'm sorry for the amateur video, I just wanted to help some people because I got really frustrated with this error too. Well, thank you. Bye.